By now, you've probably received an email directing you to a Google Meet video conference for class. The easiest way to get there is, when it's the right time, cut and paste the link into your web browser. You'll need to allow access to your microphone and camera, but you might want to disable them before you start the call. Enter a name you can be recognized by, then ask to join, and wait to be allowed in. When you do get in, you'll see a screen that has what the instructor is presenting, now this bottom toolbar has a lot of useful things, and it will appear and disappear throughout your session. To make it appear, you can click any place inside the window, and if you click inside the window, it'll disappear. If you want, you can turn on captions, which will give you a reasonably accurate transcript of what's being said. The top toolbar will tell you who else is in the meeting, and you can open up a chat window. The chat window is the preferred method of asking questions in class. If you do want to ask a question, you'll need to unmute your microphone, so click on the screen to bring up that menu bar. Then ask your question. Can I ask a question? So your instructor will run class as usual. So today we're going to do something. I'm not sure what this button does. But there may be occasional technical glitches. Don't panic and hold for a minute. This usually happens when somebody hits the wrong button. For example, you might be reaching for the microphone button and accidentally hit the hang-up button. If that happens, you can just rejoin the meeting. You'll need to re-enter your name and ask to join again. And so those are exactly all of the things you need to know for the test. We'll see you next time. And once class is over, you can either close your web browser or hang up.